Hello everyone, welcome back to Real Life Unboxing. In today's video, I'm very excited to say I just now got a brand new scent box haul in. And this one is a mixture of my subscription and some voucher codes that I got from you guys by going through the link down in the description where you get a free fragrance and I also get a free fragrance. So that is greatly appreciated guys. I really wanna thank you all for that. And I also plan on starting a second channel called Scent Hound just to do fragrance reviews for you all as well. My wife actually started a channel called Scent Fox and I'm gonna be the Scent Hound. So we'll do Fox and Hound fragrance reviews for you all as well. So let's go ahead and jump into today's video. These gold foil bubble wraps are a little bit bright. So let's jump into it. Fun fact I wanna let you guys in on is that some of these bottles of perfume and cologne that are inside of these scent boxes, you could purchase the entire bottle and it would still cost more than what it cost me for these eight cents entirely. And I get a variety as to where someone who purchased a full bottle would be stuck with that entire bottle and possibly would not have the cash to spend on other bottles to where they could have that variety unless they went through a service like Scentbox, which is fantastic guys. So definitely I will leave that link down in the description below for you to check them out. Let's go ahead and start with one of these boxes. So I'm gonna try and jangle this. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna start with the side piece and then I'm gonna slightly slide that one over there and then fix it up a little bit and hopefully we can maintain our pyramid a little bit cool 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 now let's go ahead and get into our first box this one i cannot say what it is because i have no idea still hopefully i get some new fragrance atomizer cases but this one is an old one and it is the prada la home so very excited to see this one arrive wow absolutely fantastic very light fragrance and very uh professional i would say Great for the office, great for daytime wear, and overall fantastic scent. Now, I'm gonna go ahead and move on to the second one. And what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna slide this one over to right there, and then just take that top one off. And let's go ahead and get into our second fragrance. Like I said, I'm just gonna zoom through these guys just a little bit and tell you guys my thoughts on them overall, my first impressions, because I haven't yet to smell any of these scents. And I just order based on other YouTubers and every uh, different articles, reviews on the fragrances. That one I smelled before I actually got the chance to look at the name and the tint of the fragrance itself is cool looking green. But this fragrance is Sexual Poor Home by Michael Germain. That one is definitely an amazing fragrance, a very very sexual definitely that's exactly what I, what I would say for it as well uh sexual poor home very amazing fragrance uh from first impressions can't wait to wear that one and let's go ahead and move on to this next one which this one seems to be a female fragrance this one is flora botanica by balenciaga and this one is going to be an amazing fragrance from what i read and as soon as it touched my nostrils I got that 100% verification. An amazing fragrance, guys. If you guys have a lady in your life or yourself are a lady, <laughs> check this Balenciaga out. Definitely an amazing fragrance, especially first impressions. I'm going to have to bring my wife in to verify that eventually. But like I said, she's got her own YouTube channel called Scent Fox, and I will leave a link to it down in the description below if you guys want to check her channel out as well. She actually shows her lovely face. Me, I just show my matted mitts and <laughs> just do it that way. This one right here is a brand new fragrance atomizer case. This is the first time that I've seen this, and this is Creed Silver Mountain Water. I have actually gotten this once before, but I used one of your voucher codes in order to order it again because I couldn't place it on the subscription, but I used one of my free voucher codes in order to receive that one again because that one definitely needs to be purchased twice on the fragrance sample, but it is so expensive to purchase single-handedly that I, I just don't have the money to do so but amazing fragrance. If there was one to purchase a full bottle of, it would be that one right there. Let's go ahead and move on to our fifth scent. This one right here is another brown bottle. This one's super cool. So now I have two of these. And this one is Armani Code 
Profumo. And this one right here is supposed to be an amazing fragrance. It actually does come in a slightly brown bottle just like this. The tint of the cologne itself resembles the atomizer case and everything as well. So looks really cool in the case. Oh my goodness. Yes, that one is very nice, guys. Really can't wait to do a full-blown review on this one. I cannot remember the opening notes, the middle notes, or the bass notes, anything like that from when I ordered, but I do remember looking at it and thinking, wow, that is going to be an amazing fragrance. And sure enough, it definitely is. Now let's go ahead and move on to our sixth scent. <laughs> sixth scent. Sixth scent. This one is a blue brushed looking container. It's like a brushed nickel, but in blue color. Fantastic. I actually already have this atomizer case. Let's go ahead and see what this one is. It is the Dior Home Intense. And Christian Dior never, ever, ever lacks. I'm telling you, every Dior fragrance I've smelled has been fantastic. And this one is nonetheless, although it has been this one right here is definitely the weakest already i can tell from the first first fragrance i definitely love higher energy better and then on the female versions i like joy by christian dior the uh dulce vita and things of that nature very nice and miss dior by christian dior Ooh, baby i love your way every day all right guys let's go ahead and move on to our seventh scent this one right here it has a cool case as well. I've gotten this one a few times as well. I think I've gotten it like six times overall. This one's The Sexual Fresh by Michael Germain. And that one is very fresh. This one is one of the cheaper uh, ones that are on Scentbox, but I went ahead and got it anyway. Normally I buy the most expensive colognes that I can find on Scentbox, just so I can have that large value and say, yeah, I got a $400 bottle of cologne for next to nothing. But you know, it's, it's a 30 day supply, but it's still a very valuable cologne and I couldn't get it any other way besides scent box. So really cool to have that. Let's go ahead and move into our final scent, which is going to be Mon Paris from Yves Saint Laurent, inspired by Paris, of course. I think it's Mon Paris, might be Mon Paris, but I'm not sure exactly how they pronounce it. Some of the fragrances are very fancy and I'm not really sure. I do watch another YouTuber called Jeremy Fragrance and he smashes them perfectly Every time I hear him say a fragrance name, I'm, I'm like, oh, there he is. He got it right perfectly. You can tell. And he says it with so much confidence. Such a good YouTuber. Such a good uh, fragrance reviewer in general. And I look up to that guy. That dude smells amazing all the time and you know it. Big shout out to Jeremy Fragrance. You guys don't know who he is. Check him out as well. This video was one of my favorites to shoot. I got eight brand new scents and they all smell fantastic. And I'm very glad you guys stuck around to the end. I want to thank you all for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to Real Life Unboxing for more products with real life applications. Smash that notification bell to stay up to date on our newest uploads. And as always, keep it real.